When I first came to Japan in 2003, with just a little knowledge about Japan, I thought that it won't be long until I will meet a samurai. In my long search for samurais, I did meet one at a shrine in Aomori city, dressed up with authentic samurai clothes and prepared to show a part of old Japanese history. Instead of many samurais, I have found teachers, or sensei, as they are called in Japanese. Lots of them. They're all around us. But they're not that easy to find. After 18 years of living in Japan, I'm grateful to have found a few sensei who taught me things to help me improve the way I live. One of them taught me Japanese. Another one taught me how to snowboard. Another one how to teach English. Recently I have found another sensei. He is as special as all the others and he is unique in his own way. I love snow and this sensei teaches us how to enjoy snow more. Amor is known for being the snowiest inhabited place on earth with an annual average of about one meter of snow in Aomori city and about three meters of snow at Sky Onsen, Sky Onsen has an average yearly snowfall of 17.6 meters, a winter season record of 23.7 meters and holds the record of having the highest snow depth ever recorded at a GMA certified weather station of 566 centimeters recorded on February 26, 2013. Personally, I'm head over heels, but most of the people in Aomori aren't because snow shoveling takes a big amount of people's time in winter. There is so much snow that new mountains of snow appear in Aomori and yes, they are made from the snow collected from Aomori city and sometimes the snow is even thrown in the sea. This is where Sasaki Sensei plays an important role. Since he moved to Aomori, he helped some of his students learn more about SDGs and one of them won the first prize at an Asahi Shimbun event. Sasaki Sensei is a university teacher and also the leader of six educational and environmental organizations. He came to Aomori four years ago and in this period he managed to get in contact with many locals listened to their stories and decided to do something. Sasaki Sensei gathered money from the Japanese Ministry of Environment and with the snow that covers Aomori for months, he decided to make igloos with all his students. He has built a total of more than 300 igloos and now he is building his own original igloos here in Aomori. In a cabin located right next to a local ski resort, he set up a Yuki Ita workshop and invited people to make their own snowboards. Yes, Yuki Ita is a snowboard without bindings and was invented by a Japanese. Sasaki Sensei also asked local backcountry guides from Sky Onsen to teach the participants simple but very important rules about backcountry skiing. During the snow festival held every year in Aomori at the beginning of February, Sasaki Sensei and winter enthusiasts wrote a wish on one of the many lanterns that fill the sky. The next day, the first igloo making competition was held in Aomori. Six teams participated and in about three hours, they were able to build their own igloo with the instructions they were given. The shapes and sizes of the igloos were different, but the excitement and joy of the teams were through the roof. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Is Mr. Sasaki, the sensei. 
私の名前は佐々木豊と言います、えー、と今までいろんなものを作ってきましたけど自分で家も作ったしそれから馬小屋も作り鳥小屋も作ったり去年から雪板っていう雪で遊ぶ道具も作ったりそれからイグルーも今まで作ってきましたイグルー作ったのは今から四十数年前学生の時に一個作ってそれから毎年作ってきたので今までで300機ぐらい作ってきましたけどいろんなものを作った中でやっぱりイグルーは特別だと思ってます雪だけで作るいずれ溶けてなくなってしまうけどもきっちりと確実にその冬だけ、えー、作った人の記憶に残るしイグルーだけは、えー、消えてなくなるけども一番、えー、作った上ではいつも気持ちいいが入るものです He's still thinking about more original and sustainable ways to enjoy life in snowy Aomori, put back in use abandoned facilities, and hopes that his students will be able to continue his activities. I have always dreamed of living in a snowy place, but to find a teacher who can teach me how to love snow more in the snowiest place on earth is a real dream come true. We all need teachers in our lives, and sometimes, They are right next to us. It's up to us to find the teacher who can teach us more about what we love. With love from Aomori Mihai. <laughs>